Hello everyone, and welcome to the Track Wrap-Up Show. I'm Thomas Maloney, and today at Rambler Review Headquarters, we're just going to break down one of the McBain Rambler's previous track meets. This track meet was the Highland Conference meet at Manton, which was between McBain and two other schools. Those two schools were Holton Lake and Manton. For the boys' team, they did a pretty good job. They ended up losing to Manton 89-74, but they beat Houghton Lake 129-25, so a really nice job. The girls, they swept both teams, though. They beat Manton 101-62 and beat Houghton Lake 134-26. So a really nice job there. And right before we go into the video that we got, I just want to point out that since we were down a man on this day, we just didn't get that much running because the pe the people there that were recording were all athletes, and so we had to go do our stuff and go do our events and didn't have time to record. But we're just going to get right into it, and we're just going to go ahead and check this out. To start out today, we're going to start with the 4x8. This relay was Josh, Ethan, Levi, and Aiden. They finished with a PR of 955.78 seconds, placed second. Then it was Peyton Grant. In the 4x2, Michaela, Carly, Michaela, and Peyton were on that team. PR of 154. Then it was Ben Rodenbaugh, high jump. He got 6'5", placing first. Then we go to pole vault. We're moving fast. Lydia Klein, she got a height of 6'6". Then Genesis, Genesis Wilson with a height of 7 foot. Grace Broncoma with 7'6". And Olivia Wilt with 8 foot placing her second in the meet. So a good job right there. And then for the last one that we had, it was shot put. It was going to be Wyatt Zeiderveen. He did a really nice job throwing a distance of 44 feet and one inch, placing second at Manton. So a pretty good job all around just from everybody. And just pretty, really good job. Honestly, I mean, McBain girls, they swept both teams. The McBain boys did a really good job. And that's about it for the track wrap-up show. I'm Thomas Maloney, and we'll see you next time.